Hello, this is Ethan Minsker from the Antagonist Art Movement. We're here at Mindy Wyatt Gallery. It is October 15th. We're getting ready for our Antagonist show. I'm going to introduce you to one of the artists and let them tell you about their work. Hello, uh, I'm Dan Krupen, and I'm a member of the Antagonist Art Movement. These are some of my paintings. All right, you speak up just a little bit. Let's hear about this one. This is called Stacy's Day Parade, and uh, there's Stacy right down there. That's Stacy. That's Stacy. She's quite lovely. Thank you. She's, she's a young girl, and uh, these are some of her friends and/or enemies on the top. Um, this is acrylic on canvas. I've worked on it for about a year or so. On and off. And. Uh, I like it. <laughs> Would you say your work is inspired by surrealism or? Absolutely, surrealism. Uh, my dreams, other people's dreams. Um, this is obviously influenced by the uh, Day of the Dead artwork. Um, it says is, I would give my life to be dead. And uh, there's some skeletons on butterflies. This one, La Vida Pasa, means um, life goes on, or what's happening, life's happening. And that was the first one of the Mexican-themed paintings that I did. And, uh, yeah. Quite lovely. Thank you. That one's uh, the newer one. It's called The Precious Intellects. And it's based off of a uh, Charles Bukowski quote. I like Charles Bukowski, Ham and Rye. Absolutely. And that is uh, Millions After All Survive, and um, there's a guy with no skin on. Well, I mean, she looks like a rape victim, and her father's taking revenge, and this is the guy who's scared out of his skin. I like that. It's possible. So if we want to find you in your artwork, where could we go? You can go to www.dancrupin.com. Thank you, sir. Thank you.